Okay, this is a video supplemental audio log I am doing. This is Commander Felix Macedonica on <laughs> having safely landed on Iorant JNS C170 ABCD1A, very handily titled there. So it's a quick update on the ship systems. I managed to land on the only landable planet in this system and the next system over that I'm trapped in. Just gonna have a quick check of the ship systems. Let's have a look. Uh, where are we? Modules. They're all not too bad. I'm out of AFM munitions, but that's easily replaceable once I get some materials stored up. That's not too bad, given that I've been on sort of almost a year out in deep space. Let's have a look at the inventory. Right, this is the key one here, materials. We are, let's have a look, Niobium, 31 units of Niobium, which is great. Pretty much, there we go, seven units of Vanadium, but I can mine more on this planet. Seems to have uh, and a source of them, abundant, but enough to mine for 18 Yttrium. That's it. So if you go to the synthesis menu, I look at FSD injection, you can see that I'm short on germanium. Uh, I only need one unit to make a 25% increase, which would get me out of this mess. Uh, on the 50% boost, I'm short again, one germanium, or germanium, however it's pronounced. Uh, and on the premium one, I'm lacking arsenic, which is available on this moon. And polonium, one unit of polonium, which is again not available. That would give me a... 100% boost, <clears throat> which is unnecessary at this moment. So, germanium, germanium, however it's pronounced, is the key here. Two SRVs, 133% fuel, 122% fuel, but that's easily refuelable. So, here's the main system I'm in, around JNS C1170. <laughs> Quick look in the system map and look at more details of it. Okay, so here we go. Let's pull out a little bit. Four stellar bodies. And three ringed planets. One of which, the one I'm on at the moment, has the subsidiary moon. And you can see in detail. Pretty unremarkable. No real interesting features. Nevertheless, I'm on it and it is. Let's have a look. There we go. Sulfur, carbon, phosphorus, iron, nickel, selenium, vanadium, 3%, arsenic, cadmium, yttrium, and tungsten. It's missing germanium and polonium. Germanium's the key one. No other landable planet. So we'll have a quick look at the galaxy map and I'll show you the bigger predicament. Now, let's see if I can orientate this correctly. Okay, so that's me at the moment. Or is it? Is it? Is it? Is it? No, this is me here, JNS. Now I jumped in here. What am I I think it was over here. A 50% boost from Iron PDK PDK DA4 to jump here. Where I'm at at the moment. Now, over here, which is the next system, it's 29 light years away. Now I've got a 29 light year maximum jump capability, so I could make this system. However, it only has a single stellar mass, so it's of no real use except for refueling. So, 29 light years, no problem, because over here, which is the gateway out of the abyss section that I'm in, you see that's the route heading back towards the Rodsboro crossing, way, way, way away there. 48.3 
light years, 48.31 to be precise. Let's say 49 for the sake of rounding up. So my stupidity, I figured boost over to here, easy jump 29 light years here, now 29 from, say 49, <laughs> is an easy 20 light year jump. For some reason, and I still don't think I've got my head quite around it, when I do jump from where I'm at the moment over to KNS, C170, it then puts the distance between these two at 30 point something light years, I don't know the exact figure. It's unreachable. Now the irony is, in that system, again there's no landable planets, but it is a gateway. And we can jump here. to C-16-0. Very easy jump, minimum range. Yeah, but look at that. Tons of stuff. Tons of stuff to replenish. Massively stock up on, no problem whatsoever. A wonderful system. But I can't reach it. So, I'm stuck between these two planets, C-17, 0, and JNS C-17, 0. That's that. Oh, and they're going to close down the servers. So, that was just a quick visual audio log uh, to update the situation. I will disembark on the SRV once the servers are up and booted and running again and stock up on as much materials as I can. Because somewhere out there, Commander Chiggy von Richthofen is powering his way across half the galaxy uh, to get... Let's have a look at the system map. into this ring system here which as you can see is metal rich hopefully uh, to be able to mine we also have another couple of ring systems I'm gonna navigate those and scan them later to determine what types they are and also up here there's an asteroid field which may also prove lucrative. Again, I'll scan that, see what type it is. Okay, well, that's uh, <laughs> that's pretty much the update here. Uh, for the moment, I am stuck between those two systems, and there's little I can do unless I can get materials sorted. So, fingers crossed. <laughs> External profile of the battered Lacon Type 6 here. Look at that. Almost a year in deep space. Wonderful stuff. Anyway, I'll update later with uh, more information about the details of this system. This is Commander Felix Macedonica. Out.